Hi, my name is Artaska and I am an instructor with Iron Music Academy of the Arts. In this video, I wanted to give you several tips on how you can prepare for audition. So let's get started. Make sure to pick a piece that you can prepare well under pressure. This is an audition, so remember you're going to be nervous, you're going to be a bit jittery. So you want to pick a piece that you know you are not going to bomb. So do not pick a difficult piece that's a little bit higher than the playing level that you are already at. Pick a piece that you can know you can prepare well and that you can do well and blow them away with. In the first week when it comes to preparing for your audition, make sure that you get everything that you have to get in order to do your audition. Meaning, make sure that you know what is expected of you at your audition so you will not be thrown for any surprises. When you start to practice the piece, pick the hardest passages first. Start with them first. Do not start with an easy passage. Pick the hardest passage because psychologically if you start with the hardest passage and once you work on them and you know them in and out and backwards and forwards and you can play them in your sleep by you doing that then when you get to the easy passage you're like oh this is a breeze and voila you have learned the entire song so start with the hardest passages first i don't care if they're at the end of the song beginning of the song whatever work on those first and work them thoroughly until you know them like second nature practice in front of other people yes practice in front of other people when you're first starting out and learning the song do not practice in front of other people once you know the song thoroughly or you know you're comfortable with the song then ask some friends ask some family members hey can i practice this piece in front of you that way you'll be used to playing the piece in front of other people and on the day of the audition that's going to help you because you're used to playing in front of other people so it'll be like ah oh, this is a breeze i already played in front of other people you guys you know you're just hearing my best best work <laughs> Record yourself on a recording device, whether it's video or voice. What I like to do is I like to use the voice memo on my cell phone and I like to record myself playing the piece. So after my practice session, I can go and listen back to myself. So when you're first starting off with the song, record yourself on a recording device, just to record the audio. And then once you become comfortable, you can video record yourself. That way you can see how you're looking, how you're standing, how you're posing. And you know, it'll help you to see where you are and you know, help you to gauge better and let you know what you need to work on more. Two weeks before your audition do not change any bowings or any patterns do not do so because your hands and your arm and everything have already learned that muscle memory do not do this because if you decide to change your bowing or the patterns two weeks before the audition your hands and your body's gonna like hey what am i supposed to do because for weeks i've been you know memorizing <laughs> how everything's supposed to go and then you just want to switch it up that's that's not gonna work that's gonna work against you on the day of your audition so do not change any bowings do not change any patterns because you don't want to jack up that muscle memory do not practice a lot on the day of your audition as well as the day before your audition. You don't want to overwork it because if you do so, it it's gonna it's gonna cause some problems. And I know you'll feel like, well, I'll be more prepared if I practice a lot on the day before or the day of. No, don't do that. Give yourself a rest. Just practice a little bit. If there's something that you just need a little bit more confidence in building up with, like a certain passage or something like that, then yeah, you can go over that a little bit. But do not do any heavy practicing on the day before or the day of the audition. Arrive to your audition early and get used to your surroundings. What I suggest is arrive to your auditions like an hour beforehand. So that way you can get used to the place and you can just get grounded and get in the space that you need to be mentally and physically in order to do your audition well. So get there early. Do not get there late. On the day of your audition, don't forget to breathe. Yes, breathe. I know it's something so simple, but sometimes when we're under a lot of pressure, we forget to breathe. So don't forget to breathe, okay? And have the mentality that I got this, I can do this, 
I prepared for this. I am prepared. I can get this. Let's go. Have that mentality and breathe. And guess what? You're going to breeze through it because you have this. Thank you for taking the time out to watch this video. Don't forget to subscribe and hit that notification bell below so that you can be notified when I have more videos. Don't forget to go to iamusicarts.com and check out my courses that I have available.